Now, scientists in Spain are investigating why increasing numbers of orcas, also known as killer whales, are targeting fishing and sailing vessels, damaging their rudders. It's believed the behavior, which is at the moment is thought to be a game, has spread to 20 of the individuals. Victoria Gill reports. On a trois heures, là. Are these animals attacking or playing? For more than an hour, five orcas nudged, rammed and spun this yacht around. It's one of at least 100 incidents this year and scientists are trying to work out what's driving this strange, dangerous behaviour. Playing with the rudders, they break the fibre and uh, the, the rudder split on the back, so it was completely split. So and, did that uh, end up in the water? Yes, and this floating, so this, and they, it, because it's floating, the... the the orcas were playing with it, like from the bottom, and like playing with uh, on the on their nose. Yes. In this boatyard in Barbate in southern Spain, they've repaired at least 40 sailing vessels damaged by orcas since April. Here in the narrow Strait of Gibraltar, a population of fewer than 60 critically endangered Iberian orcas move through one of the busiest waterways in the world. In the nearby fishing port, some crews say their boats have also been a target. We have seen them and they punching us a few days ago, sailing an hour from here. They have always been there, but they never come near us. But in the last few years, it has changed. Scientists are examining footage of these encounters that's been taken by sailors since 2020, when sailing vessels started reporting that orcas were attacking them. It's thought the first encounters began four years earlier with just two young, curious killer whales. Now scientists say up to 20 individual animals have learned this behaviour. By pinning tracking tags to the animal's fins, a technique used for many years to study them, researchers here are gathering information that could help sailors. Thanks to the satellite tagging, we are able to know where exactly how to say the sailing boats and motorboats, how to leave the area and to not cross the, the main area of the killer whales. What are these killer whales trying to do? It's only a game. It's not a revenge, it's not a climate change or, or nothing like, like that. It's just game and that's it. That game is focused on the boat's rudder. After orcas broke the rudder of a French boat earlier this year, they appeared to play with the floating debris. These incidents have become divisive here. Wow. For tourists on a whale watching boat like this, They'll wait for hours just for a glimpse of these orcas. They're a spectacle, but sailors and the fishing industry here are desperate to understand how to avoid them. Wow. For sailing crews that are navigating these waters, if they see the orcas, what do the scientists suggest that they do? Full ahead. Full ahead, the motors, and uh, straight on, don't change the course. Wow. Even that's not clear. Other official advice for sailors contradicts it. These marine mammals and their unusual new habit is putting our ability and our willingness to share the ocean with its wildlife to the test. Victoria Gill, BBC News in southern Spain.